Greetings friends and my valued viewers welcome back to our YouTube channel preferably you are fine like before enormous news for dinar just dropped I by and large endeavor my best to give you the revived information so this video is about the latest announcement of navigating the Iraqi dinar evaluation hit become involved with stay informed and comment in the world of investment, particularly with high stakes assets like the Iraqi dinar. It's crucial to approach developments with a balanced mindset. As the situation evolves and critical events unfold, investors need to stay informed and adaptable. The phrase put on your big boy pants emphasizes the importance of maintaining composure and clarity amidst uncertainty. This means staying vigilant about the progress and potential of your investments while being prepared to make strategic decisions based on emerging information. The essence of this approach is to continuously monitor and evaluate the situation regarding the dinar's revaluation, RV. It's not just about passively waiting it's about actively assessing whether to remain invested or pivot to alternative opportunities based on new developments. While the enthusiasm for the dinar's potential revaluation has been high, the reality of the investment landscape requires a more nuanced stance. The process of revaluation is complex and dependent on various factors, including regulatory changes, economic conditions, and geopolitical influences. The commitment to the dinar's revaluation has been a long-standing belief for many investors. There are specific milestones and conditions that need to be met before the revaluation can occur. This understanding hasn't changed over time the core factors driving the potential for a successful RV remain consistent. However, the dynamics surrounding Iraq and its financial policies are continually evolving. Recent changes and the involvement of international entities like the US Treasury in Iraq's central bank, CBI, have introduced new variables into the equation. Currently, the investor's stance is described as being in the neutral zone. This means holding off on major decisions until more information becomes available. The choice to stay invested, rather than making a hasty exit or shifting to different investments, reflects a strategic patience. By remaining in the neutral zone, investors can better position themselves to react to forthcoming developments without the pressure of premature decisions. The message is clear, stay informed, remain adaptable, and be prepared for change. The current phase requires a balanced approach to acknowledging the potential of the dinar while carefully observing the evolving situation. The decision to not exit the investment just yet underscores a strategic wait-and-see approach, allowing investors to make informed choices based on how the scenario unfolds in the coming months. Thank you for watching. And if you have any questions or need further clarification on any of these points, please let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more updates on the Iraqi dinar and other financial news. Until next time, take care and stay informed.